hello everyone. Hello, my name is Igor. I'm a co-founder of a Estonian startup called SchoolOS, which is school management software for growth hacking your kids. But before we start, I have a question. Do we have parents here? Raise your hand, parents. Whoa, beautiful. I'm a parent as well. I have two kids and I have a statement to make. Schools suck. They don't care about kids. They don't care about what job they have, how successful they are, but we, we parents do care. And I feel like there's a need, there's a gap, there's need to be for something or for someone to be our personal mentor during this education process. Luckily, we put ourselves in a mission to solve this problem. We've created a highly scalable and customizable school management solution for growth hacking our kids' potential to help parents, teachers, educational authorities to make more informed decisions and to actually discover those hidden opportunities to help our kids. Let me tell you how it works. We set a goal to become a school management software in developing countries, just because of the sheer amount of the market that we have. Uh, so we find local representatives in different countries and we start a pilot. And a matter of fact, it takes only a couple of weeks to customize the product to the uh, local markets. Then we import all the historical schools data in our system and give it to teachers. So they use it on an everyday basis, like feeling great, home assignments, absence alerts. Then we take this data and analyze it and we provide personal counseling to teachers and parents on how to improve our kids' performance. Together with our strategic partner, which is a company with 15 years of work experience in emerging markets, we've created a solid go-to-market and a scale strategy to become a school management software in 15 countries by the end of 2018. And we believe this is a very uh, sustainable and feasible strategy because of the experience we have right now on the markets that we've launched. Once we launch a project, we have a very positive viral feedback from the governments, so they give us a green light to go on a national level. Uh, so yeah, we also have, uh, before that, we also have a very strong business model. We sell uh, business to business, business to government, business to client, uh, and uh, also, we are actually committed to create intelligent platform, making education more personal, informative, and transparent. Of course, we have superstars to support this strategy. We have Chicago Booth MBA graduates. We have high-performing sales entrepreneurs. We have strong CTOs. And just to name a few, we have a British School of Design designers with us. Thank you very much. That was School OS, school management software for growth hacking your kids. Thank you very much. Thank you. Give it up. Thank you, Igor. Perfect in time. Let's go on with the jury. So, so this is a question or a statement. Um, take it as you will. But um, uh, you didn't talk through the feature set exactly of what you offer. Yeah. I've got two kids in school. They're nine and seven. The biggest pain point for me as a parent, and this is because nine-year-olds and seven-year-olds are morons for the most part, is um, paper, permission slips, money, that kind of stuff. And I don't know, do you interact, do you do a lot of the parent-student, parent-teacher sort of interaction about getting permission slip signed, sending money for a field trip, that right, sort of stuff? Right, right, right. So what we have, what we have is just very standard, but very user-friendly and uh, design-friendly school management platform, which allow teachers to actually manage every day, uh, every day their job. It's like uh, putting grades, home assignments, teachers' comments, communicating with the, uh, with the parents, uh, absence alerts, so these kind of stuff. We're not trying to invent a bike and create different solutions like e-learning or LMS. We actually on the road to integrate with those guys and take their data and analyze it. So we, we ha we, we've, we've set an mission to create very solid, beautiful software that will be used on a daily basis in schools. So can you talk a little bit about your go-to-market? Because at least what we see you know, in Scandinavia is that selling to schools or government and so on is quite a hassle. Great question. So we have a very, very cheeky strategy. So first of all, we find local partners in different countries. Like we were already launched in uh, Tajikistan, Nigeria, Ukraine. So what we do, we find local representatives in these countries. We launch a pilot with 10 to 20 schools. So then we have a feedback from, actually, we, we get noticed by the governments. So uh, once we have attraction from the government, they say, whoa, whoa, we love it. So they give us a green light to go there. So the, the strategy to find local companies, private companies, launch a project with them, and then get attention from the top, from the educational authorities. And then we go on scaling very quickly. It's like a fire, boom. So this is the strategy for us. So can you... <clears throat> Can you give me just like one concrete example 
of how you're able to actually improve educational attainment. Absolutely. So we, uh, we have all this data that at the end of the day, within a couple of months, we can analyze this data. I can say, look, your kid, here's your weak side of your kid. Here's sorry, sorry, no, 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 I said one concrete example. So something, this is live in market, correct? Uh, yeah, yeah. Can you give me one concrete example that's actually happened in the park to an existing client? So uh, what, we, what we've done in Tajikistan, so what happens is the parents get information like, uh, this is the uh, strongest uh, part of your kid. This is the uh, subjects that if you don't pay attention to them, in three months, they will get worth. So basically, we're getting all the information and analyze it and provide like a recommendation to parents. So this is the example. So how is that different to a school report card? So school report card is that basically you have uh, your best subjects, your worst subjects. So we, we are trying to analyze uh, not only the, uh, the, 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 uh, the grades, also the absence alerts. We take this in, into account. So how many times a kid was absent? the number of time the teachers actually communicating with the parents. And we actually, on the roadmap, we have a system that will analyze what teachers are actually sending the information they're sending to, uh, to parents and then take it into account as well. Yeah, just a um, quick comment as a Finn. I feel very proud about the school system. I'm a little frustrated. You can't say that the schools suck when the customers are your teachers. Partly, they should be bored of it. So don't go blaming on the sucky bar. Uh, find another term as a feedback, just. Thank you very much. And, and then again, uh, the paying part. So, so I just quick, well, we don't have the time. Let's take that privately. So the paying part. Right, OK. Thank Amazing. Uh, Thanks yeah. a lot. Thank you very much. Thank you, Igor. Great job.